Oh is, my god. I know. I can't believe the Forever King gave us all of this. It's amazing. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Well, uh, my, my line's gonna be better than yours. Just saying. Like, what? No. Yeah, right over there. No, over here. Yeah, mm -hmm. way better mm -hmm. over there. No, with those houses? No, that's, that's, that's the shit. What the fuck land. is over there? Is that corn? Well, Who eats corn anymore? Oh, uh, that's pumpkins, my... actually. So, I can already tell you're going to lose. Mm -hmm. You know what? I guess the Forever King will decide. I guess he will. And he loves men more than women. How did I know? Hey, everyone. Huh? Welcome back to <laughs> no. Fat Nest and Your Run Throughs. And this time, we're continuing on with Chada Stone. Game three, baby. Game three. My name is Mr. Wilson. <laughs> I'm here. This we finally showed Cat. Did it? That rat. <laughs> Sorry. I'm... No, what are you doing? I'm in my basement, kid. Get out of here! Get out of here! <laughs> You're lucky your mother isn't afraid of me. Uh, so, yeah, we have the guidepost. Score the fewest objectives. <laughs> in the. Yeah, fewest. Just don't do them. In these early <laughs> stages of village building, the Forever King encourages you to focus on progressing the village through construction and, and unlocking crates. You're still adjusting to the frequent communication you receive from the Forever King. It's mainly through a vague interaction on Facebook. <laughs> like, oh, I'm sorry to hear that your grandma died. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Before you moved out here, the closest contact with him was through tax collectors. Why does he care so much about your little village? Because there's, uh, I don't know. Because we're all Sims. Yeah, he doesn't care about us, he just cares about the stuff we do for him. You know, the Forever King is kind of shady. Like, who just gives land to people? And I know it, it seemed like it was all nice and it was a great gesture, but... I don't know, maybe I'm, like, ruined by all the other stories where nothing is as ever as good as it seems, you know? There's, there's something about him. Yeah, and apparently he gets fucking... Bitch ass mad if you care about coins. Those well, are yeah, because he already has enough coins. Those are his coins. He wants the resources. He. Forever King doesn't even have a name. Uh, you're actually the first player. Does he need a name? Hello. So. So, um. <laughs> How do I play? I know what the fuck is on my shit. Those are the. Well, oh, yeah, those were the peril tokens. That's what they were. So, let's see. What like... were the colors again? It was. I don't know. Brown. Red is. <laughs> Bandit. Black is fuel shortage, blue is disrepair, green is vermin, purple is blight, and yellow is famine. Basically, some buildings require extra. Though they require those cubes to actually do them. New places are the brick market in Squibbleville, oh. and then uh, wow, yep, <clears throat> the granary hmm. in in the forest. Lovely. So, Lovely. So that's that. So, by all means, go on. Yeah, um, I guess I will. Your uh, cats kind of look like rabbits for some reason. Well, it's because they are. They're a mix. Yeah, um, I've been breeding cabbits. <laughs> so, or rats. Whichever one. Whichever one. I've been breeding rats. <laughs> you you mean... very confused once you saw them. <laughs> yeah, they're very fluffy kittens. But they're, uh, I couldn't come up with a better name. Have you seen that cat that looks like a fucking, uh, possum? No, is it a possum? No, no, it's, no, not like a... It's disgusting. Cause I, cause you seen that video of that blind girl playing with her cat and it's a raccoon? <laughs> yeah. I don't even know if that's true or if that was just a joke. I don't know. Um... But it is your, your go. And, uh, I'm trying set, to think. You set all my shit up so wrong. I don't, I'm sorry. I, I just, just signed a second. <laughs> I'm leaving you. Oh, we're in our new house! Yay! Woo! Hey, officially our house. Like, we're not renting this shit or anything. Yeah, we can scream. We can, we can scream. We can just scream. We can just, I can do this all I want. Uh, you still can't do that while you <laughs> play. Yeah, I'll literally, uh, murder him if he keeps doing that. Now, not literally, because... I don't want to put myself at uh, risk for interrogation here, but I will. What if I do it with all the coins? Uh, that'd probably be an even worse idea. What if I do it <laughs> until you actually take your turn? And, then, and been... then I'll stop whenever you take your turn. I found one. Well, now I can't think. I literally can't think. My brain just shut off. So I, need a, I need a black what? <laughs> what? How do I do this? Nothing. There, you just take those when you go there. Do I just take them? Yeah. Oh. Some buildings require them. As Later. 
Ament. That's what happens when we run out of them. Nothing. They're just there. Okay, alright. So, I have my sexy little hot gams grandma over here, um, prospector mode. Yep, yep. So I got Cat Whisperer guy. Okay. You better shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'm gonna go ahead and... <clears throat> yep, that sounds pretty interesting. <laughs> that was pretty much it. I'm gonna go here. <clears throat> okay. I'm gonna pay my dang old iron to get two coins. Two coins. Nice. And do I take that purple thing? Yes, you do. You just put it off to the side. Some buildings require them. Um, cool. I just heard something. So, when does this trigger that after using a building with the metal cost? Uh, immediately. So I, I would get that? Yes. So that's a victory point? Yes. Move over, you bunch of little bitches. <clears throat> Alright, we got... <coughs> Red is going to the Zeppelin. So you can move him over. No. I the the, no, what the hell are you doing? He has workers. I don't know! <laughs> no, that's him! He is getting three points, though. Yeah, he's not allowed to do that. <laughs> And then he's actually going to go up on the uh, progress. No, he's not. He's going to build a building is what he's doing. Um, he's going to get to just build one. Yep, drafting room. I think that's draft. Yep, drafting room. Drafting as in like... <laughs> as in drafting. As in like... <coughs> drafting, Jesus. drafting beer. Yes. Uh, and then I'll just go anywhere you want it to. While also oh. advancing that. <clears throat> okay. Let's see, let's put, there's the clay pit, let's put, let's put it kind of over here, in the industrial side. I'm wondering what happens if you, if you fill up your own thing, because I only have one more building to build there. I thought we'd place shit over it. Do yeah, we? I think I asked you that, like, the very first, even uh, before we played, I was like, oh, so you're limited on to what you place, and I think, I think. Did, did I say otherwise? I don't know, Seth, I can't remember. Uh, <laughs> well, that's building cards. Constructing a building. Yep, on an empty plot using it, so no, you can just only put it in an empty plot. Well... So I only have one left? Uh, so, yeah, looks like it. <clears throat> looks like it, yeah. I'm sure after this one it'll change. Well... Oh yeah, I guess if we do get new rules, yeah. Yep. Oh, that, that goes back on there. So... Oh, it actually gets discarded. Oh, it actually gets discarded. Did we get a new one right there? So did I tell you that I started this in? <clears throat> uh, I saw that. Uh, guess what happened? All right. My sim went to make some macaroni and cheese, and she fucking almost burnt her house down. Thanks, thanks, buddy. You're welcome. You get some of that metal. You can get that. Uh, now Mr. Oh. Wilson is going. You gonna smack someone's ass? <laughs> in a major way. Perhaps. He's going to greens. Whoa. Greens lowest <clears throat> number. Uh, which is this one. I don't know if he takes those. I'm gonna go with no, he doesn't. No, he He's gonna gain two points. I would I would assume he wouldn't mm. take them just because... Right. Because like, they don't take resources or anything. Exactly. It's your turn. Well, um, right. It's just like... Yeah, I do. I love The Sims. I've, I've had it on my uh, laptop since I was in high school. And then my laptop broke. And the new laptop I got couldn't run Sim, so I haven't played it for a long time, and I finally got it for the Xbox. And it's just such a perfect time waster. You just... It's wonderful. Where else can you just drown someone and be okay with it? We have to work so hard to get shit. We do, and that's what I was saying last time. And they, they, don't, <coughs> they don't do anything. They're perfect. They're a CPU. Um, here's two coins to give uh, another robot. Again, another robot. Uh, it's, yep, it's and a victory robot point. robot and a victory point. Oh, Mr. Wilson. Uh, yeah. Alright. Red is Baboom getting one victory point. And he's going on the top oh, left quota three. spot. Um, and he's also going to get a reputation. Top left quota? Yep. Okay. Yep. And a reputation. And a reputation, of course. He I just need, I need one of those. I need an influence. Yeah. Dang, it was close. Right there. Alright, now it's my turn. That's on the right spot, right? Everything's on number four, right? What? Oh, like last yes. time. Like... <laughs> yes, everything is on. Hey, the game's half over. <laughs> no, it is not. Did you go to? Did you go there with a robot? Yeah. I hate you. Why? Because that's what I remember. Can I go anywhere else to get coin? To get coin? Hey! Yeah, your dumbass pumpkin badge. 
Uh, yeah, but I don't... Oh, I do have a pumpkin. Thank you. You're welcome. I could have let you struggle, but you helped me. That's a victory point and a coin. Okay. All right, that's that's my go. So. Sweet ass go. Yep. Yep. Pokemon go. Shut up. That's copyrighted. That doesn't make any sense. Oh, I don't have any clear cut, but what the fuck is what's what the fuck's happening in here? Oh yeah, we need three <laughs> reputation. <coughs> Two assistant cards. Yep. And, and then three different types of. And oh, we only have two, so, so that one's that, not. Yeah, that one's out. Well, until, uh, yeah. There's no way. Well, there is a way. There's no way Mr. Wilson's not getting them. Probably. Oh, we will. Uh, how, is how, that Mr. Wilson's turn? No, I haven't gone yet. Oh, okay. I'm asking you a question. Yeah, what's up? How do we get um, the little sailboats again? Oh, uh, well. How do we get onto the influence? How do we get Over there. this? The reputation? Yes, yeah, sorry. <laughs> I'm like, well, there are cards that will give you reputation. That thing will give you a reputation. The quota, the cloud port up there will give you a reputation. You just have to pay three. Well, you just, uh, yes. Three what? Three of anything in that row. So three coins, three, uh, Resources. yeah. Three workers, three peril. So, so that's how that works. Yeah. Okay. Gray Worm getting two points. And I don't know why he's going to the Charter Stone. Oh, and he's opening a crate. Lowest number. What a fucking surprise. Right. 22. I guess we could, like, disrupt <clears throat> them. Like, take their shit. <laughs> Build the things they need. What do you mean? Well, they just always take things from that. Yeah, I know. So... Well, I guess I can do this console gets refilled. 22, so 29. Um, 28. 29. Oh, shit! Rule 18! I think that changes on this one. This icon means construct a building. Ah, damn it. Yeah. I don't know if anything changes on here. Um... No, not no. Okay, rule 18, constructing a building. This icon means... I think it was rule 18 right there. Okay. Construct a building in your charging, you said build card. Okay. Then, pay three influence tokens plus the resources shown on the upper left of the building card. Uh, at fix the building stick in your chart, it can be placed on an empty slot or any building with no tokens on it, but not a basic resource building. So now we can build over them. Okay. okay. Gain victory points and advance a progress token. Uh, construct building cards. If the constructed building card shows a crate, place it face up in your personal supply. Otherwise, place it in the archive. End of campaign value. If you construct a building on top of another building, only the victory points shown on the newer building counts at the end. So not a basic resource building, so anything that says oh, so basic. basic on it. Basic bitch. Cool. Okay. Cool, cool. I was wondering, I was like, well, what is that? And then, then I saw it. Right. Okay. Oops, I opened up the wrong one. Seven. God damn it. I meant to open up seven, oh, no. which is 24. Oh, no. Hey, private objective cards. Oh, no. <laughs> That's what fucking happens with fucking legacy games, so whatever. You know, mistakes in these kind of games is just a permanent reminder of our idiocy. You know, it's just like, oh, yeah, look, uh, yeah that, I remember, that's where I fucked up. Cool. I'm stupid. Great. So we can't do that right now. Just remember that. We'll do it later. Yeah. Yeah, that's the problem with legacy games. Yeah. It's like, oh, well, that's that now. Yeah, because it's crate seven. Uh, so rule 21 is uh, going right there. So private objective cards. Eh. The Forever King seeks loyal servants to achieve his various objectives, both in public and private. The player who unlocked this crate may gain one of these objective cards at random. Shuffle the remaining cards into the objective deck. On buildings like the Botanical Gardens and the Pavilion, you may gain the top card of the objective deck. It becomes an objective in your personal supply that only you may accomplish and score. Discard all private objective cards at the end of the game. So that was that. <clears throat> okay, so 7. 7. 25 is, hey, the Botanical Gardens, 
which allows you to get an objective okay. for the pumpkin. Um, he gets that? No, it's just going to go in the discard pile. Oh. Seven, 223. 223. Oh, he got a version of me, the ambassador. Whenever you gain an objective card, select it from the top three cards of the deck, put the others back in any word. Those are going to go in his thing. And then general supply, 220 and 222. Those are going to be objectives. Yep. Yep. So we got overachiever, score at least three objectives. Spread your influence, have three or fewer influence before placing one on this card. Um, and then card mogul, have at least four different types of advancement cards. So those will go into just on top of that deck. In here? No, on the objectives. Oh, oh, just on top of it. Yep, and that, uh, that is that. Okay. Um, and then that's going to go in the archive. And let's just remember that, um, here, I'll put, I'll put, uh, 29 back, back in the box. I'm not going to peel it off. 26, 27, 28. Okay, 29. We'll go right there. Well, hey, I mean, we kind of knew we were going to be building on top of that anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh, fuck. My turn? Yeah, after Green One. Okay. I mean, I think it should be my turn, but... Well, too fucking bad. I don't know what you think I've done, but if we were to battle, I've already won. Um... Let's go ahead and go to the Pumpkin Spicery, spend this coin uh, to get a higher person. Ooh, what is this? What does Granny Slip Taint do? <laughs> when you use the market, you may gain one reputation. Yep. She's helpful. Um. Um. I don't want her. I want... This chick, the broker, and I'm gonna name her Mella. Uh, from Scooby Doo. Yeah. That's, how is that normal? What's wrong with I don't know. You know anyone in real life named Velma? Not in real life, no. Velma's kind of an old person name. Exactly. Uh, and old people aren't normal. Oh, so I got I got this now. Does Jesse and Dalen do they know where we live? No. <laughs> Um, it is now Mr. Wilson's turn. He's going to gain a victory point. Oh, victory point, a reputation, and he's going to go on the quota. Will you give him a victory point? Absolutely not. I know, I wish you wouldn't have to, but he's going to go right under that red one. All right. Okay, Here so. Here go. I haven't done this yet. So, you go to Cloudport. Yes. And you take one of your influence tokens and influence. place it somewhere. What, what on what I want. Yes. I want that one. Okay. And I'm paying three coins. Okay. Because I'm in the coin spot. And then you take one of your influence and you place it over here. Okay. I guess coins would work. Just a jump start me. Well, yeah, of course coins would work. Seth. Oh, I was, I was asking for that one. Um, red. Oh. Yep. I was yep. giving you both. Gray Worm is going. He is going to blue your... Middle number. Um, three? I've got two of them. You I've got three threes. of them. You have three threes? Yes. Um, the one that's it, Z to A. Z to A? Yeah, so... So we're... So what do you got for your threes? I have the iron market, refinery, okay. and wood market. So it's going to go to the refinery. Okay. Uh, oh, God, I have to recall already. <laughs> I suck at this game for some reason. Look, I feel like I'm doing a lot. Like, I feel like I'm constantly working my workers to the max and doing everything efficiently, but at the same time, I feel like I'm not doing enough. Maybe that's just how work replacement games actually are. Okay, so that's, um, that's all I got. Oh wait, when you place a cat, oh well, I got a victory point for placing my cat. Oh, oh that's right. Forgot about that. <laughs> Cannot forget about that. Okay, so Mr. Wilson's turn. He's going to uh, the 
charter stone, so he's going to bump Grey Worm off. Uh, gain two victory points. Wilson? Huh? Mr. Wilson. Yep. <coughs> uh, he's going to open a crate, so we got 73. Oh, uh, goddamn. Oh. 31! <laughs> I was like, that's not right. 31, so 75. Ooh, hoo. 75. Guest cards! It is 31, right? Yes, yeah, 75. You're seeing an increasing number of travelers, which is odd. Where else are they going other than your village in the Eternal City? The longer you can entertain them, the more benefits you will reap. The player who unlocked this crate may gain one of these guest cards at random. Shuffle the remaining cards into the advancement deck. Whenever you have an unnamed guest card, you may name them. Whenever income is activated, which is now on that, in reverse player order, starting with the current player, gain the benefits indicated in the upper right of each guest card in your personal supply. Gain both benefits in two to three player games, and either benefit choose each time income is triggered in four to six player games. So, now we have some sexy new people showing up. Mainly to see my, my charter. Of course. But... I mean, cause they're get the, we'll get the fucking. I keep thinking you're metal or you're you're coal. You're metal. And <laughs> come on, kids, find the shiny. That's that's you. Find the shiny. <laughs> and then the, in Squibblyville, it's black along. Yeah. Uh, thirty. So seventy six. Um. Dang it! There we go. Aha! So that's what that's the symbol for guest. The okay, suitcase. Okay. So we got that. And then, 293. Um, oh, it's probably a Persona. That's probably mine. Oh, it's actually Grey Worms, not the innkeeper. And that was Mr. Wilson. Okay. Damn old Mr. Wilson. Yeah, I fucking hate him. Okay, three. And then 281. To two, okay, two eighty one to two ninety two. Oh, hey, I got them all. Sweet. <laughs> yep. So this is just what they do. Oh this wow. This is who they are. Um, and then in a two or three player game, which we're not in anymore, you would gain both of those. But now we just choose if you have them in your in your place. So I wonder. Oh, I guess that would be a card. So. He wouldn't get any, because they just all go in there. And that was that. Okay. So now it's your turn. Okay. I have to recall. Fun, fun. On my peeps. At least he'll have to recall next turn, but Red's going now. Yeah. All right. He, uh, he is going to his own spot. Uh, lowest number. One. Yep, so that's where he's going to go. Uh, he's going to gain two points. Okay. <laughs> he's, he's where I want to go. That's not true, actually. Never mind, because I want to go there. there and spend that. You and gain, exploit my lands. Gain two coins. Alright. Don't you fucking dare. I will end you, I swear to God. Don't fucking touch me. Okay. Alright, it's your go. No, it's not. It's Mr. Wilson, and all he's doing is recalling. Now it's no, your go. It's don't you dare bump him. Who? Grey Worm? Yeah. Maybe I won't. It's just, it's just, they're so hard. They are. Um, it's not even that they're hard, it's just that they're just so like, oh, do this, do this, do they this, are, do they this. Are literal, like, they're literal perfection. Right. That they cannot make a wrong Right. Move. Um, <clears throat> well, we're just like, <laughs> fucking yeah. like, working our ass off. We're, we're, just like, yeah, we're literal humans. And we can make errors, and that can cost us. They do. I make buildings like humans do. I stand like a human. <laughs> Normal human standing. Yeah, I mean, I, I wish, I wish, I was just the perfect CPU. I wish I could do everything literally perfectly. But oh well. Don't mind me, just that. I guess we don't have to play with Animas, but but we're gonna. So. I have already forgotten different ways. I have plans in my mind of what I want to do. To get on my reputation track. 
I have plans on my mind. You have plans on your mind? Yeah. How do I get onto the reputation trail? Uh, up there, and you're, I think you already asked that. I did, I, said I, I cards, just said that I forgot. Cards and, and other shit. I want the card. Well, I don't know. That one? Well, no. <laughs> but, oh yeah, well, oh. Granny Slick Tank. Oh yeah, Granny Slick Every time you use the market, you go on the reputation track. Yeah, I guess that's true. So, Velma the Broker, I guess I probably could have come up with a better name. She just kind of looks like Velma. I mean, she's not a redhead, but if she were... Velma wasn't a redhead. Velma was totally not a redhead. No, she wasn't. Why did I think she was a redhead? Because Daphne wasn't the redhead. That's right. I think it was the red sweater. Orange. And the big old schmeckles. Orange with a red skirt, but okay. Wow. I want you to know that scooby was you... my favorite as a kid. Wow, I watched Mature. I had a Like Courage, the Cowardly I Dog. I had a Are you drooling? No. Have you been crying? <laughs> <laughs> we should walk normal. I had a Scooby-Doo sleeping bag, and I had a Scooby-Doo stuff in here, and I had a Scooby-Doo birthday. That's where I got all my Scooby-Doo stuff. <laughs> That's hot. It is. I was like 19 when I got it. <laughs> <laughs> no, when I was growing up, Rugrats was my shit. Oh, well, fuck Seth. Where should I go? I don't know. Don't but will you me. just go somewhere? Will you go to the Iron Market? Please don't yell at me. <laughs> Why do you want me to go to the... So you can bump me. You know, I was thinking about going there. But you don't actually have any fucking metal, so that's why you can't go there, you fucking punk. So where the fuck is the rest of your metal? Well, I spent it to get two coins. Uh, Grey Worm is recalling. Oh, yeah, he is. And I'm gonna go up there. Oh, you got three victory points for going there. I forgot about that. That would explain that. Um, so I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna spend three peril. Three peril. To place. So you get three too, right? Yep, I'll get three there. We're all tied up. To get a reputation. What? And whenever you go to Cloudboard, gain plus one victory point. What? Plus one victory point, bitch! Uh, Alright, now unfortunately Mr. Wilson's coming back to go to yellow. His own, his own spot. Shit. To the highest numbered one he has won, so he's gonna go there. You know, we could kill he's Mr. Getting, Wilson. He's getting two victory points. We could. Two victory points. But if we were to battle, I've already won. Now it's your turn. Okay. Uh, okay. Alright. So. I did that. Alright, I'm going to do... Put him right here. Take that. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. I didn't even see that. Oh, I don't have a coin! No, you gain a coin. Oh, you gain a coin? Oh, sorry, I don't know what happened. I was, like, what? I was thinking of the one where you have to spend it. And so, yeah. Here you go. Okay. Um, Grey Worm. Can my robot go there? In your own spot? Right there. Yes. Oh, if he's mine, then. Yeah. Yep. Sure. Grey Worm's going to black. Uh -oh. Highest number. So he's going to the brick market. Gaining two points. Mainly moving them like all when they're all stacked on each other. Right. I'm gonna go to the cat cafe. Yeah, I'm getting your point. Two coins, gain my point, and get another cat. Oh. Yay! Okay. I'm a cat whisperer. <laughs> I'm just like I'm just I smell like piss all the time. <laughs> all. <laughs> smell like pumpkin and piss. Pumpkin piss latte. Yum. Um. So, I uh, red not red yellow's gonna gain two victory points and discard. The two highest numbers, which are Granny Slick Tank. No! Tank. Not Granny Slick Tank! And then that one. Um, so now we got the Kiln and then Plankton. Oh, Plankton. Fucking, fucking it's a normal name. Uh, Alright, now it's your turn. I'm actually going to recall everybody. That's, my, that's me. But, yeah, I mean, yeah, you can recall them for me. Oh no, I couldn't grab them. He's too far away from me. Okay. Alright. Alright, so... Grey Worm. Oops. He's gonna go to his own spot. Lowest. Highest. Highest, which is there. The drafting room. Okay. And he's gonna gain two points. Oh. Oh, just a big game of fucking hopscotch right now. Mm -hmm. Right. And... Let's go ahead and go there. Pick that old dimmy dang 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 up. For, and then for one influence to gain a 
pumpkin and a victory point. And another victory point. Unless you already gave me one for my cat being placed. Not yet. You didn't? Okay, cool. I'm just giving one for the last cat. Last okay, time. cool. Yeah. Now we got Mr. Wilson. <clears throat> He's going to his own. The lowest, which is there. He's going to gain two points. Good job, Mr. Wilson. Will you move him up? Like I said, it's just a big fucking game of hopscotch right I know. Uh, now it's your go. Alright. Gonna go back, get some more lumber. I see what you're doing. <laughs> what else can I do? I don't know. A lot of other shit. I guess that works though. Um, okay. So, now we got Grey Worm going, going to green. green. Uh, going to the middle number. Um, there is really no middle, middle. See, the problem with the Autobots is that they're not even predictable. If you were playing against another human being, you could look at them and be like, okay, I see what you're trying to do, and I can, you know, try and stop you in the best way possible. With the Autobots, they just do whatever they want to do. Okay, so it's like, it's not even, they don't feel like another human being. Probably the lowest number, yeah. He goes in that order, so he's Gray actually gonna bump you off. Grey Worm has no more people. Oh, then he recalls. Yeah, I was like waiting. Just shuffle that again. then. Uh, now it's my turn. I, I would have loved to have be bumped off, but. So when you retrieve two workers, gain two victory points if you retrieve at least two cats. Oh man, man. So. Two VP. Yep. I got it. Cool. Oh, I don't got it apparently. Yeah, yeah. Come on, you're embarrassing. I know. Uh, Mr. Wilson's recalling. Oh. That went there. Okay. Now it's your go. Alright, now it's Grey Worm. Okay. And his action. Alright, he's going to his own spot. Highest number. Grey Worm, highest number. Back to the draft. Uh, yeah, but he's getting two points. Um, okay, that seems pretty cool. My turn. Let's go to the pumpkin spice, yeah. spend a pumpkin, uh, gain a coin, and another victory point. Two victory points? Yeah. You get two? Well, because my pumpkin market gives me a victory oh, point. I see. My cat gives me I a victory point. Um, Mr. Wilson is going to go to the market, actually. Oh. And he's going to discard the two highest cards. Like a dickhead! I know, right? So there's that. And then, oh, Siap! Hey, Siap, what's up? And then the windmill. Isn't that nice? Now it's your turn. Huh? I said thanks. <laughs> Just really quietly. <laughs> yes! Coin and a reputation, holy shit. And a rip rip. Okay. Red is going to go to his own spot, lowest number, and gain two points. Fuck them. Okay. They're coming to you, aren't they? Yeah, I'm just, I'm trying to think how best I want. I want to do this. Um, because he already took that spot. Is there a place you can get multiple resources yet? Other than just money and a resource, no, it's just, yeah. Right. Um, yeah, and that's something I want, unfortunately, but... Ooh. That sounds pretty cool. Let me, I need to look at that, that spot. Um, the shoemaker spot. When you select another Persona card from your charger and activate it, in addition to another Persona card you're using this game. That's not what I want to do right now. Reputation isn't going to work. The monument allows me to get... Is that already a constructed building? It is. There's no constructed buildings there. That allows me to hire people. Um... Ah, fuck me. I really want to win! Yes, that's what we all do. But they're going to win. Not if I can help it. 
Well, I'm sneaking up on you, so. Right. Uh, let's see. Sorry. I'm sorry. Uh, but I'm not doing that. Okay. So I guess I will. Oh, it's the market that allows you so to coin. Okay. Well, then I guess I will just go to my garden, get one of those. Victory point. And a pumpkin. Mr. Wilson is going to go ooh, to my spot. Middle number. There's two threes, so we're going to go there. Um, and he's going to go to my pumpkin one, and I get a victory point. Because he went to a spot with my cat. And he's going to gain two victory points. Okay. Your turn. Okay. I'm going to... You know every time you place a robot, you get a card, right? Yeah. I'm trying to think of the time. I don't think there were any cards that I wanted when I was placing robots. Now there, now there is. Right. Um, so I can do that since I have... Uh... With the way your strategy is going, CF is who you want. CF is who I want. So you're my two coins. I get another robot. Yep. And I get a point. And I get CF. Who just gives you a point. If you when go up you on the it? reputation track. Ah. Which is what you, you're doing. Seems to be your go-to strategy. Hey, look, there's Charles. What does he do? Oh, when you go to the treasury, you get a you get an influence back. Uh, Grey Worm is actually recalling. Do you recall Grey Worm's people? So I was thinking. Uh, there's something I was doing. I really don't want to go there, but I do at the same time. Um, and unfortunately, it's pretty fucking shitty, mm. and I hate his face. Who's this? Mr. Wilson. Oh, Mr. Oh, you got to knock him? Yeah. Fucking bitch. But, I think I think I got it. I think I got it. I'm going to go there. Coin and a resource yeah. to get a card. And which card do I want? Oh, 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 in my booty. I'm going to get the kiln. Yeah. That seems like the right thing to do. You know, this ain't a portal. Oh. oh shit. What's it do? If you go there, you actually just advance the progress tar marker. Huh. Right? Mr. Wilson? Yep. Mr. Dang old Wilson. Oh, yeah. I was like, god damn it. Okay, so he's going green, highest number. Right oh, there. why couldn't it be the lowest I number? I know, right? Gain two points. <laughs> Oh, they are coming to you. I know. Leave me alone. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay. All right, my turn. Yep. It's like. All right. What are you guys even? What are you guys even doing in the Forbidden Fortress? Is it Gray Worm? Gray Worm. He's going to the Charter Stone. Two points. He's opening up a crate. There's nothing to open, um, so he's advancing the progress. Mm. Oh, he gets a reputation. Does he? I couldn't even see it. That's dumb. I would have tried to advance it. I mean that. Yeah, me too. Um. Okay. Well. Oh, my turn, right? Yep. Yep. So, the most logical spot to go is the hoist house. Spend. Because I like to hoist up my own caca. I'm gonna get a coin. Not a coin, I don't know, a coal and a coin. <laughs> Yay! I can look. And then he's recalling. Your go. Robot. Domo origato, Mr. Roboto. Domo. Do, 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 do. Domo. Do, do. Domo. Domo. Gray Worm is. Oh. oh green! God. Highest number. God damn them! And he's getting two points. I'm convinced that this game is against us. Most likely. I'm convinced. But hey, we won't ever have to play with him again once we're done. Like somehow we can kill them. Somehow they just know like where I'm at. Okay, so now it's my turn. I have to recall I'm recalling two cats, so that's two points. That shouldn't be it. 
So it just it just basically feels like it's Seth and I trying to at least just beat the NPCs, um, and I don't find that enjoyable. I've never ever really found playing the computer fun, and I don't like to do it in board games. Like at all. It, it but it is. Yeah, because this game is fucking. No, I have my Persona the Cat Whisperer. I hate him, and I'm gonna kill him. That's me though. That's so bad. I'm Cat Whisperer Seth. <laughs> One. Go, Mr. Wilson. He's oh, gonna go the right thing. there. Gain one point. Uh, gain a reputation. Uh -huh. How many reputation spots left? Uh, five. And he's gonna go right there. Okay. So now it's your turn. And now I'm, I'm recalling everybody in my colony. Okay. My me and my me and my robots. Okay. What was your persona? Oh, metal cost. Did you get a point for your metal cost? Oh, I didn't for my little robot. Yeah. 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 I'm sad. I haven't used that too often, though, this game. Okay. Oh, hey, he has to recall. Get them out of my sight! <laughs> okay. I think... So I have that. That's where... Oh, wait, it was right up there. Right up here. It's all good. I'll get all this peril and disease and coochie. Soiled coochie. Soiled. That ha that's what the Forever King really doesn't like. It's the soiled coin. Coochie. And can you give me a sack of grain? I sure would like that. That sack of grain. Okay. I just throw it out the door. I'd be like, what the fuck? Go fucking get it. <laughs> Your go. Mr. Wilson's go? Shh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want them to go. <laughs> I don't want them to. Is that the chart? You, Mr. Wilson. I hate him so. so he's getting one point, and then he's getting a reputation, and then he's uh, going up on the quota track again, just on the far left. All right. On the far left? Yeah, right under his already. Oh. Yeah. All right, your turn. Well. My name is Mr. Wilson, and I'm here to say I'm gonna smack your ass in a major way. What are you doing in my basement? Get out of here! Get out of here! So I'm gonna go ahead and... Mm -hmm. What? Spin your woody. Yeah, hello. That is what there I you mean. go. Getting old Charles? Okay, yeah. Getting Charles in charge? You don't even know what that is. No. Oh shit! Who's that? We don't, I don't know. know. Yeah, we don't have a name for it. As you, after you use the charter building, gain two victory points. What? After you use the charter building, I see. I see. It's Grey Worm's turn. No, it's not. He's gonna go to his own spot. I Lowest know. number. Low. Yep, and he's getting two points. Yeah, I would say that's, that's like such a common phrase. This game, of course he is, and that kind of sucks, Dookie, because I have to, I have to kick him. Don't you just hate it when you have to suck, Dookie? <laughs> I do, because I love sucking that old Dookie. I know. All right, I'm gonna get my, my clay, and then we got uh, Mr. Wilson going to the old Zeppelin, uh, getting three victory points. Yeah, I fucking hate him. Like the, like you do. I'm so popular. Billy, you really are. You were doing so well earlier. He's building the lowest number. I'm playing the long con, don't you know? He's building the coal market. And these shitty fucking... I don't know what they were thinking. With making Those cards bend, yeah. I... That sucks. Which, I mean, I guess since it's a legacy game, it's, it's fine that they bend. But... But it's not, it's like... It's not the fact that they bend for me, it's the fact that they're still hard to get off. Mm. Um, coal market, we'll put it right there. See, for me, it's the fact that you have to bend it to get them off, and if you want your, you know, cards to look pretty, but... I mean, you don't, no legacy can. Yeah. Um, so there's that. You also don't have nails. That is also true. So that's whatever. Uh, and he's advancing the progress, and no one has any people for income. Right. My turn! Yep! Wow! Okay, well, I'm... Wow! Wow! 
I have Whoa! To bump his little bitch ass off. Why? Cause I have two people. Oh. Oh, you're actually doing the objective thing. Yeah. Oh wait. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 You don't take the objective. You put oh, the thing on, on it. it. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Cause you can go on there too. Yeah. So and I don't... think that's fucking stupid. But I vote five. Well, that's why they have the personal objectives now. Maybe I've wanted them all along. I was just ahead of the game. Advance that. Oh. 3P means 3, three points. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um, so he's going now. His own. Hey, Lois, that bumps me. Grey Worm. Grey Worm bumps my ass. And he gets two points. Thank you. I'm going right back there. <laughs> so I'm bumping him off. So wow. Just mess, like you were running or something and you like <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get that coal. <laughs> it's clay. <laughs> Gotta get that clay. It's the head trauma <laughs> that I got. Um now Mr. Wilson is of course being a big old fucking dickhead. <laughs> and he's building this like, like they do. Dickhead. Eight Eight is thirty-three. Can't even see anymore. <laughs> it's not in here. So oh, is that the one that we opened next? Time? No, I don't know. So thirty-four. It's also not in here. Two thirty-four. Oh, it's ghosts. <laughs> when you place a ghost or an opponent using your ghost building, you may gain one reputation. What? So, so wait, that's Mr. Wilson's ghost? Well, no. We just have, we just have ghosts now. So then who gets that ability? Huh? No one? It's whoever gets a ghost. I, I would like that. How do we keep track of the ghosts? The same way we keep track of the other ones. Can I have them? <laughs> uh, you can go to their building and get a ghost. I like them. I mean... They look like pine trees. <laughs> look like white, white pine trees. But, but yeah. I guess I'm up close. Oh, I guess I am seeing that. But yeah, they kind of. But. But what? I mean, you know, that's kind of a hard shape. Otherwise, like I don't know, making them look like white Pac-Man. Yeah. Pac-Man ghosts, I guess is what I meant to say. Not Pac-Man. So. That's them. And then we have, oh, so that was that, what was it, still eight? Eight, um, so 35, eh. Oh, now also not in here, what the fuck? 229, 229, it's also probably not in here. It's not! Did you have to take out certain cards? No! And then 228, also, oh well, I guess I don't know that. Nope, not in here. Well, that's, that's that, I guess. Where the fuck? Like, because there should be a, now a building to get a ghost. I did eight, right? Yeah? Yeah, that's just apparently the way that goes. Because it's, it's 33, there's 32, and then 38. So that's pretty neat. And there's no 34. And it says, there are multiple ways to unlock this. Okay. Then 227. Um, yeah, there's 226 right there. Then it goes straight to 230. Cool, cool. Then there's 35, and then 229 goes from 226 to 230, and there's no 35. So... Cool! Well, I guess that's fucking that. Hey, no way to get ghosts, apparently. Till probably way fucking... I don't know. I don't know, but that was that. So we opened that. Maybe the ghosts are for next game. I guess. That's the only way they're gonna show up, so. Hey look, it's Magic Mike! Oh yes! Sweet! 
when you use the Zeppelin, gain two victory points. Uh, who was that? Whose turn was that? Mr. Wilson, because he was going to build the, you didn't put his thing on the charter stone. Because he got mad, remember? No, he doesn't have to go to the charger stone, he just does it. Oh, he just does it? Yeah. Oh. Um. No, wait, no, you're right. You're right, it was the charger stone. Okay. Um, so advance the, uh, track. Mm. Up one. All I need to do is advance the track. Alright. It's your turn. Yep. Alright, so I used my robot. I just, I don't understand. I'm so confused as to... What? <laughs> why, why there's no ghosts. I don't know. I mean, it's a legacy game. Maybe perhaps we'll figure it out later. Well, that's the thing. It's like, we got one for the cats, we got one for the robots. Uh -huh. None for the ghosts. What'd I say? I told you I was going to jump to you. Just playing the long con. Advance that. And I get my thing like I wanted to. Yes. Except, you're going to lose this. Oh, no! That matters. Hey, I'm, I'm not really pro-king at this point. I didn't no. vote for it! <laughs> well, I didn't vote for it! Um, okay. So is it... Oh, it's uh, Grey Worm's turn. So he is going <coughs> to go to the Zeppelin and knock off Mr. Wilson. Oops. And he's going to get three points, because, you know, do. like they do. Oh, he's going to build something. Oh, okay, great. great. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, probably something we want. Probably. The lumber mill. Mm -hmm. mm, just the lumber room. You can put it somewhere over over there. Eh. And then, oh, I already gave him the three victory points. And then advances the track. No, tourist two. Now it's my turn. Oh, you taught children to count and spell. Uh. Fuck. Do I want to recall now? Um, I'm not sh quite sure if I do. Nope, I think I know. Wait, so then they're gonna go. Then he's gonna go. Then I'll recall. Nope, I'm gonna recall right now. Okay. Is one. Okay. Is two. And now Mr. Wilson. He would have to recall if Grey Worm hadn't helped. The reason why I'm recalling right now instead of the later is because I feel like if I can get my main workers back, I'll be more efficient in future turns to be able to get something done. You know, I like I, I don't want to break up a chain to be like, okay, well I'm gonna you know get this material, oh then recall and then build later. I don't know. It just feels more efficient, right? Um, so he's going to blue, highest number in blue. Here's my six. There you go. Two points. <clears throat> okay. So, now it's your turn. Yeah. I do too. <laughs> like, I hate these Olimas. Because... I hated them before, any, before it was cool. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's just like... I just got that feeling. I was like, they're just gonna be so fucking broken to us. And I know that there's supposed to be like a scaling thing, but right now it's like big old middle finger right in front of your face. Right. And then Grey Worm going <coughs> to the grandstand. What? He's going to get a reputation. And then he's going to go under that quota, very bottom one. Okay, my turn. Uh, so, god damn it, I was hoping I forgot he has to go to the Zeppelin. Actually, this is gonna work out pretty sweet for me. So I'm gonna go to the cloud port, spend three, uh, two, wait no, spend three, put that there, so I'm gonna get three, four, get five points, 22. Nice. Okay. Um, Mr. Wilson is recalling. 
Your go. Mm. I'm going to recall. Me too. Because then, fucking Grey Worm's recalling, and I can do my shit. Unless you suck a taint. What? <laughs> Unless you bump him for some weird reason. Uh, why are you getting so many robots? Because that's the genetic Oh, yeah. Other places you can get your points, too. You know you have to have three different... I'm not trying to do that. Oh, okay. I thought you were. Oh. Hold on, but I'm not doing things. Um, yeah. See, you thought the robot sucked. Give me magic, Mike. He's dead. To you, but not to me. And even if he was dead, I would still use him. And then, oh look, the grain market. All right, he's recalling. He's recalling. Oh, my ribs itch. <laughs> <laughs> like he's recalling. Get. I hate them. Now fix all that. No, you, I don't even know where these were. What do you mean? They're mine. And you flicked them. How'd they get over there? I don't know how they got over there. Set. See. <laughs> where would you have had them? Oh, they're on the objectives. Damn it, Seth. Will you calm your fucking tight nipples? <laughs> God. They need to be loosened! <laughs> Will you put the ghost back on the oh. thing? You While mean, I go to the zeppelin? You mean the pine tree? <laughs> yeah, will you put the fucking pine trees on the thing? Three. Here are my four resources. So there's that. There. And then that. And I built the kiln! You see, I did it. It's the one thing that I use in my fucking place that doesn't make sense. Okay, that's five points. One, two, three, four, five. And they're just gonna hop right down there. Yes, they are. Because that's just what they do. Everyone's watching. Let Mr. To Wilson see what go. you do. Everyone's looking at you because they just do whatever the fuck they want. Going to the Charter Stone, gonna get two points. Yeah, they're gonna bypass me because of the reputation shit. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna lose because I worked real hard and they just slipped a card. So. I mean, we don't have to play with this. No, we don't. And I'm probably not going to from now on because they're super fucking broken. Um, anyway, so yep, he's just doing, he's just opening that crate. So, 12. 36, which also doesn't exist. 38, 32, 38, yep, so 37 doesn't exist. Hey, 38! The Apothecary, which gets you, holy shit! There we go, requires two p purple, and you go there to spend it and you get four points. Oh, damn. When the fuck does that come in? Whenever it shows up on the deck. I would like it to. So that was 12, uh, 38, 2, 30. And that's probably, that's 224, 2, 30. See, it's like, it's my fucking persona, and they just steal them. There's like some underlying plot twist to this. What? And there's some underlying lesson. Don't play with the fucking shitty... <laughs> Um, and it says extract only one type of token, and that's I. What? <sighs> okay. I don't, I don't get the persona thing. Like, if if they're tied to a specific character, why can other people get them and use them? It's like I get the persona part, but it's like you literally have a picture of the guy. You have a picture of Mr. Wilson. Why you, as the Chinese man, why do you get that persona that's clearly his? It, that part just doesn't make sense to me. Have I already done this one? Okay. I have. Oh, it was the blight tokens. That's what it was. Okay. Uh, so that was him. So now it's your turn. And that was the... That was that, so... I don't know there's like, there's a lot of cards in there. Um, I'm going to take the last one. And I get a victory point for this, yep. 
Nice. Okay. Oh, that got advanced whenever I went to the uh, thing. When you advance the progress token, gain one point. Yay. Alright, so now he's going to go, and he's actually just going to go to the spot. Green! Highest number in green. So the granary. Grey Worm. Oh. And he's going to gain two points. Now it's my turn. Okay. What do I need? I know... Okay. If I do... Because I beat the Automas if I choose not to do that. At least I beat the Automas by doing that because I think they fulfill, yeah, based off their guidelines, they do something. Um, so let's go ahead. And I know I'll beat them if I fulfill both of those. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, babe. I like, don't know either. Well, just leave me alone. <laughs> like, like I have one more successful turn after this, and and then that's it for me, pretty much, for the rest of this game. Is it? Is it? Well, why don't you just get the fuck over it? Oh, that, that gets uh, that gets flipped. Okay. So I need two of those. Okay. I will go there and get a pumpkin oh. and a victory point. Get your own damn victory point. I remove me. Okay. And Mr. Wilson is going to his own highest number. And it's tied, so it's highest to A, so he's going there. And he gets two victory points. Alright, your go. Like, I have like one last ditch effort, and that's to rip my wiener off. I'm not even trying to win, I'm just trying to survive <laughs> at this point. Okay, so I'm gonna hand over two of these and four of these to open up a box. Gotcha. You would. <laughs> you gonna put a person there <laughs> to open up a box? And you bump him! Thanks for nothing. Sorry, box 24! It's actually box 24. That one, right? Box 24? Yes. Uh -huh. No, it's 42. 29, which doesn't exist. It actually does exist. Oh, that was the card. That was the actual rule. So now we can build over our... You said 24, right? Okay, so 67. 65. 66. 67, hey, you got a constructor. There you go. Um, 276. That would be 279. 77. 76, so that's another persona you got that will go in your box. What? Yeah, it looks nothing like you. It actually looks completely different. No, it's just the same. <laughs> That's it. That's all you got. So. So that's that. Now, not see yep. Gray Worm <coughs> is going to yellow, actually. Uh, we hand me his worker. Are we gonna fucking bump him? Probably. Oh, sorry. Hand. Sorry. He's gonna sorry. go there. Okay. That's all he's doing, so now it's my turn. Two. <clears throat> God damn it. Go there. Spend my pumpkin to get a coin and two victory points because I used my cat. Yeah. Now it's Mr. Wilson who is now going to the market, gaining two points, and then discarding the two highest cards. So we got the grain market and uh, the inventor. The inventor. It's your turn. I have to recall everybody. Yeah, you do. Fucking punk. Actually, this could be a very boring round because I'm recalling everyone too. Yeah, and then they're just gonna go. And I'm. Oh, they're recalling as well. Oh, they, okay. And no, I get two then. points. Okay. And then he's calling, recalling everyone. He's recalling everyone. And then it comes back to me. 
Yay! No, he would have recalled, and then I would have gone. Now we're skipping you. <sighs> yeah, you go. We'll just skip him. Yeah. Thanks, though. Actually, I don't remember where he was. What do I do? What do I do with these? Did you already open that? Yeah. One? It gets discarded. Okay. So. Yeah. Um, I am, however, going to spend my last. Oh, some sexy guess. And the apothecary. <laughs> and this guest, yeah, during income. If there are, okay, yeah, it just says, yeah, a vassal. Um, Tom vassal. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. <laughs> uh, a coin or a wood during income. If you want to get him. What are you doing? I'm going to use my robot to go here, but I'm also going to use my robot to get my card. Oh, you're getting that one, I see. Yeah. Then he would have recalled. Yeah. Um. Eh. Okay. Now, it's my turn. And I... Is there really no way to just get a coin? There is, actually. It's going to come to me. Um, mm-mm. Well, I mean, I just... I don't. Are you going to go to red? No. No. Black series. No. There's lots of ways to get a coin set. Yeah, I know. But I'm wondering which one's the best one. There are, like, so it doesn't require me to give up a, a resource that I don't have. And there is... It's going to be the granary. I have to give up a... Yeah, 33. Which gives me a grain and a coin. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Wilson! Yay! He's gonna go somewhere broken. Oh, look. It's there. To get two points. Like, if they're gonna get to do that and everything else, they shouldn't be getting fucking points. So. Not so many points. Like. Like, I don't we have know. to bust our. Like, we get more points than they do, but we have to bust our ass to do it. And they just get the fucking. Yep, shit. that advances. Waste our own fucking time. Um, like you know, it's weird because we we only benefit from the automas because they build buildings. Like even though they go in their own charters, they we can still use them. We can still walk over there and use them. And the the other buildings, you know, the the crates and stuff that we can open, we we get that too. So they pretty much just do things quicker that we reap the benefits from, but I think it's just the idea that they just draw a card and then do it. Whereas we have to you know, work our ass off to get all the materials and then build it, build it later on where they just, I don't know. It feels different even though I don't know why we're complaining. And then 43. Um, that's what he's opening, so 15. 15, 33, which I don't believe is in here. I think I've tried to open 33 for like 15 times. 34, also not in here. Nope. 234. Hey, how much you want to bet it's not in here? You want to bet me money? I'm not a gambling man. It's not! You owe me money. 45. Um, that one may be in here. 142. Yep, 45. It's right there. There's the haunted house. I don't know why that was a separate thing. It's 15. And then 235. 235! That's a medium. Jeez. Cool. Uh, who was that, Mr. Wilson? Oh, look, another persona. Because you know they don't even use these, they just go in, like you draw so one, can't have them. and you just mark it. Oh. It used. I'm pretty sure they get points for it. So. Do you get points first? <laughs> Do you get points for not doing anything? What? And yeah, tuck box is already, already got that. So, now it's your turn. Everyone's looking at you. Metal cost, give me two monies, and give me a point because that's what. I just don't understand. Like every single time we try to hand stuff to each other, it's just like, Ugh! 
It's just like here, or like I go to you go to grab something and I let go, thinking you grabbed it, and you were just like. And I was about to grab it, really. You just let go too soon. Um. All right. We it's, need to like we need to do a handoff where we need to make eye contact. He's and going say, to his own spot. Okay. Where? Lowest number. Now it's my turn. Lick my ass. Um. I really don't want to, but. There's that. There's my two influence. That middle finger wasn't for you. It was for Mr. Wilson. It was just. Four coins. I'm opening up that. So one, two, uh, three, four, five. Well, maybe you will win. I don't think so. Because he's going to get. You're going to get ten points. He'll get seven, but he's already going to catch up before that ends. Oh, wait, you went, didn't you? Advance that. Oh. Because you, you're out of influence. So. And the track is full, so. Yep. So 32. 33. Is that in here? I don't think so. No! What the fuck is number 33? 34 is not in here. 297, which is also probably not in here. Um, is it? Is it? Oh, it is! A golem. 32. 297. Yep. Whenever you place a golem or an opponent uses your golem's building, gain any one resource. Oh. Those are gonna go right. Gonna go right there! Uh, 32, so that's 82. Haha! -ha. See, this one gave me the fucking ghost. And that actually comes to me. Gave you the ghost? Not the ghost, sorry, the golem building. It's called the guard tower. And then 298. Wait, why did you get it? Because I'm the one who opened it. I thought Mr. Wilson opened it. No, I opened it. Oh. <laughs> it's like, fuck you! No, I actually did the work to get it. I'm just so used to them taking our stuff. I know, right? That's cute, and he's right there too. That's where he lives. Yep. Oh, you weren't looking. I wasn't looking what? He's right there. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's because he was supposed to technically build him. Like, this is kind of how it works. Well, I got a persona. Whenever you retrieve workers... Oh, it's if I have two columns. That's not the right. I've been so busy putting in stuff in there because they open them. That. Yeah, because they beat us too. Okay, so that was 32. Um, yeah, 82 and 98. And then box. Box 4. Got it. Got it! And then that's gonna go right there. Here are the golems. They look like. They look like houses. They look like brick houses. They look like the ones. Huh? Did you say that she's a brick house? She's a brick house! <laughs> we put those on there. She's my, my, oh. See? There's only one though, okay. but look how he landed upright, so <laughs> I think we're really... Look how that landed, just how I would've put him. Boop. Call him, call him. Okay. Don't say okay. Oh, so that was, uh, that was my turn. Now it's Mr. Wilson's turn to gain three points, so he only gets one point. Really fucking good. And he actually just goes, he can't get any reputation, so he's going to go up there. And I don't think they get shit for that. Where's he going to go? He's going to go up to the top left. Um, full quota. Uh, it is okay, well, he, he doesn't. Um. Doesn't gain any benefit. He just they just take up that spot. Gotcha. Okay. Hey, that wasn't too bad. It's your turn. She's a brick house. Uh, like I could ensure my victory. Okay, I'm not gonna get my card. You're not. I have enough. If I get too many, I'm just gonna get rid of them anyway. Right. Right. Uh oh, I forgot to. I forgot to flip. Is that, oh, a knight. Hoo hoo. A knight. So it's, uh, oh, it's his turn. Grey Worm's turn. Well, so he's going to go oh, to his own spot. Middle number. Whatever the most middle number is. Uh, well, there's a 1, 3, a 6, and an 8. 1, 3, 6, and 8. I've probably been doing that wrong this whole time. 
Yeah, yeah highest value. That's what I thought. Um, if there isn't a second or third, simply stop counting and choose a building. Second highest or the third highest value? Second highest value is the third. Is the third. Sorry, that's the second lowest. Um, so it would be the six. Yeah. So put them on the six. All right, gave him his two points. So now it's my turn. All right. Uh, so I have, I do have a resource, but it's not a resource I want. I have no influence. Um, can I, will I make it back in time to do some sexy shit? I think I can. I'm gonna go there. Get a pumpkin. Get a point. Uh, Wilson. He's getting two points, and he's going to blue with the lowest value. Hey, but does, what does, well, I guess I don't need it, because... You would gain a card since he's going there. If you wanted one. No. Are you sure you'll gain a benefit if you have a worker? Or if you have well, a visitor, because income will happen. That's true. Which one, where's the suitcase? Both of them? Yep, both of those. So you can either choose one to get a point or a metal or a coin or a wood. Let's go with the point and the metal. Okay, what are you going to name her? She's, her? she's a knight. I know, She's right? Clearly, she doesn't conform to gender stereotypes. And then it'll be your turn after you name her. They made everyone weird looking. Like, why is everyone happy? <laughs> what if, like, they made, like, the cards, like, all cards had a sticker on them, and, like, this game took, like, a shit, like, shit turn, so the Forever King becomes evil? I think he is evil, sir. Hold on, let me finish. He becomes evil, and like it says, peel off all the like, and so like we like peel this, and all the all of their like uh, unhappy, like they're no longer smiling. Like he has like no eye. Oh my god! Half his nose is gone. It's your turn. So do I do I get a victory point for her? Or is it... no, it's just if whenever that moves on the track. Oh, it actually moved on the track before you did that. So what are we on? Move that forward once. Okay. Right. So we'll have to do it again, which is... You'll do one more time. Gotcha. I apologize. Yeah, thanks for that. Well, what you gonna fucking do? Pee my pants. You know me. Oh, you have to have influence to go to Cloudport. Yeah, you have to have influence to do a whole lot in this game, buddy. Which is why I said I only had one more meaningful turn, and it was it has since passed. Mm -hmm. And that's why I've been scraping by. It'd be cool if there were places you can go that gave influence back. I'm sure there are later. Charles, oh, there are. Charles, the windmill. <laughs> I was going to say Charles gives your influence back yeah. to you. But at this point, I'm just like, man, it's even fucking worth it. Right. Oh, look, another guest. Yeah, so the windmill will let you. Where is the windmill? Right there. Oh. You have to go there with a resource, so that'd be pretty neat. But Charles is... <sighs> this fucking game. So there's really no point, because they're just going to keep racking up, and there's nothing we can do to gain... We're just going to gain piddly-ass points. Mm -hmm. Cool. I don't know. Because I can't even do the objectives if I wanted to. Alright. All right. At this point. It's your turn. Okay. I am going to go. That's the treasure, right? So I'm going to go get rid of my metal mm -hmm. to gain a coin. Yep. And I am going to use Charles's ability, and I am going to get one back. Okay. Uh, Grey Worm is recalling... Okay, now it's my turn. That advances because I'm out of influence. Mm, that's right. Yep. Um. I guess I could go to the market. Oh wait, I don't have any coins. Oh well, yes I do. I can go there. Right. You just gotta pay for that. So this could be two points. You just have to farm hardcore. Yep. Gain a coin. And Mr. Wilson's Yay. going. Yay. Two points, and he's getting rid of the highest value, or the two highest value cards, which are going to be these two. The two guests. Oh, uh, yeah, that's, it's, it's your turn. Who's that? The who? We haven't been yet. It's Thor. It's the lore. Oh, it is. And we got a judge. Oh. Okay. Well, that's, it's pretty neat, I guess. So, yeah, it's your go. There's a spot that was built. I'm gonna recall. Wow, what a fun turn. 
Um, Mr. Butthole. I just hate waiting for them. Goes, he's gonna build lowest value building, which is the windmill! Oh! Eh. Yay, I'm actually not happy. Okay, there we go. I was like, because I can't get that fucking card off. Let's put the windmill right there, right by the refinery and the lumber mill. I thought you were going to say right by the refrigerator. Right on the refrigerator. So this is going to go away. My turn. That advances. Progress. Um, I'm going to recall, so I'm going to get two points. Because I recalled at least two cats. That's nice. And now it's Mr. Wilson's turn to suck ass. Um, he opens another It's more crate. spread out now, though. Huh? Like between all those? Oh, what the fuck is she? She's a sorceress. She's a fucking Scarlet Witch. Yeah, they don't have any abilities. They just made different people. Yeah, I know. But just look at her. There's Thor and Scarlet Witch. And he's going to open this one. So, 41. Or Scarlet Banana, whatever her name is. Scarlet Banana. <laughs> uh, 98. Which has probably already been opened at this point. That's 102, 100, 99. Oh no, 98's still here. Oh shit. So if you have two influence and three metal at the clock tower, you can open a crate and get four points. And. I do not know, 41. Yeah, 98, 306, and 305. God damn it. Yep, 306 and 305. Oh, look, hey, it's one of your people. That, once Granny. again. Who took it? Mr. Mr. Wilson? I forgot to put them on there. So, a vast portfolio have at least three building cards. That's an objective. And, yeah, he steals your, your person. When you move the progress token onto the in the income icon, gain three victory points. I'm sure that'd be nice to have. That would've been really nice to have. Except for some reason they get it. Like if it's a persona, like why the fuck do other people have it? I haven't gotten one of your personas. I've gotten someone else's persona. Is that it? Forty-one. And then three oh five. I think I just did that one. Yep. So now it's your turn. And it doesn't move up because you now have an influence, right? I do. Okay. And I'm gonna go. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, well, I guess I mean they might change. I'm going to go gonna. up to the cloud port. Spend it. Sorry, got a little out of control. Spend two coins. Um. Oh, sorry. I spent it there. <laughs> Huh? No, my, my influence. Oh, your influence, I yeah. It, yeah. Yeah. Damn it, it rolled well, out! It's because you hold it like this, you're like, hey. Yeah, I hold it like that. Yeah, you just did. No, Everyone yeah, saw literally it. just Everyone now, saw yes. It. Everyone saw it. Oh my god, like, comment, share, and subscribe, she would just want to lick a big butt sandwich. <laughs> like, big ol' butt! <laughs> this game. Uh, yeah, after I... I fucking hate you. And that's why, it's not the Automas, it's your phone. Are you ready? Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> uh, yeah, after I was done having a stroke, um, because I was so fucking angry, I just, I don't like the Automas. I don't want to play with them, and someone could argue, like, oh, well, it's just like playing with your other friends there. No, these are not real people. That's what upsets me, is because they do everything perfectly. They can do no wrong. Their turn is just a waste of fucking time, and they take it out on set, because I'm mean. I fucking hate the Automas so much. Anyway! No. So do I get three points for going there and, and one point for landing on it? Yes. Okay, so I get four points. I already moved you up three. Oh, gotcha. Did you already give me I don't two coins? I remember. I'm almost positive you did. So I'm, a, I'm handing these back to oh, you. Oh, that's because I dropped them. <laughs> no, that's because why was I building these? Because you had to pay it. Okay. Anyway, it's... Gay fucking Grey Worm's turn. He's going to black, highest value, second highest value, which is going to be that three. Here, 
black is down here. Um, and gain two points. I don't even want to keep up with them anymore. Right, it's just like, well, move me on to that windmill. I just gave up. Where did that come from? Probably on the Zeppelin, yeah. Windmill. On to the windmill. Yep. To the windmill! To the wall! Uh, Mr. Wilson is recalling! Woo! Oh, that went up one. Oh, did it? Yep. Hey, I get a reputation. No, I don't. <laughs> now it's your turn. Did you get Mr. Wilson off of here? Oh. Get the, get get the, the fuck away! Get that fucking old man off my dick! It's my turn! Should have named him Mr. Should have named him Mr. Diggles. Mr. Diggles. Tickles. Mr. Dickles, and they can get together with Dr. Knockers. <laughs> Why the fuck not, buddy? You can't do that. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> give me a coin. <sighs> and give me my one rip. Give me my... So close. So close. Point. Really close. No. Okay. No, my reputation. Oh. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Charles. Okay, now... Grey Worm. Oh, he's gonna get two points. He's going to open a crate. No, he's not, because there's not one there to open, bitch. He's going to move that up. Oh, no. Oh, it happens. I get Brienne's ability. And I oh, did he name her Brienne? Brienne of Tarsia. Yeah. That's funny. Um, give me one point. All right. Thanks, Brienne. I'm bumping yo bitch ass off. Siup doesn't even fucking help, help me anymore, and Magic Mike doesn't help me because I can't I'm even... bumping your bitch ass off. Oh, thank you. So, I'm spending two of these to place that one right there. So that's three, four, five. Five points! Right there. Okay, so that, well, that was that. Now Mr. Wilson gets to go. We're so salty about Mr. Wilson. We really are. One point, he would get a reputation. He doesn't. He instead goes right under blue up in the core of the place. Yep, um, well, so that, that's that, now it's your turn. Okay. Well, you yeah. You have ended the game a long time ago. I'm gonna bump you up. Hey, yeah, thanks. but I'm fighting. <laughs> right. Um, and I'm actually gonna spend two of my little minion boys. Oh shit. I know, right? Just to go under him, so that's four points total. Thirty foe. Yes. Alright. Alright. And now, Grey Worm, two points. Um, he's gonna go into his own spot, actually highest value. Which is his eight. Damn! So can he bump my dick oh, off? You can't get that lucky. My little old dickle. I did you a favor. Now you gotta bump me. I can't. I don't have any more influence, which means that moves up. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh wooey. Oh wooey. <laughs> um. I love how he like throws the pizza down. <laughs> Okay. Uh, is there any place I can go to get more victory points? <laughs> hooey! Hooey! You got any schmeckles? You just got one So the garden. It's gonna be a point. Give me a, give me a dang old pumpkin. You got it? Yep! And Mr. Wilson's probably gonna get like 15 points for no reason. Probably. He's only gonna get two and go to my spot. Um. Which is the lowest value, actually. Oh, which is, which is actually my garden. Great. It's gonna give me a point. Thanks, buddy. So he actually helped me. Alright, it's your turn. Uh, it will go up. So, do I get one last turn, or...? Oh, it actually ends the game. Okay, so, that's great. Alright! So... Endgame shit! Okay. Guidepost. Eh. Uh, yep, yeah. score the fewest objectives. So obviously not you, because <laughs> you went for two. I wanted that! Um, each Alma scores none, so I also scored none, and I believe I fucking beat them if I tie. Um, I'm like, the player with the most influence tokens in the personal supply reveals the option of the guidepost. Oh look, I guess not! Well, they can't do that, can they? We choose for them anyway, so fuck it. Oh. Okay. We can technically flip one, and whatever reveals at the bottom will be their their choice. But they can fuck right off. Give them the bad choice. 
Oh my god, yeah, this is like way better. I know, it's fantastic. It could also be just this material. I was also wondering that, but I feel, I feel, just give it a shot and play there. No, we don't cross games. How boring. I know, right? How unoriginal. What? <laughs> you think? Alright. There we go. So, if you would like to include the end of campaign building values when calculating VP totals this game, open crate C. If you would prefer not to have the building values factor into this game score, open crate D. Uh, where are the victory point totals? I can't remember. Is that how much? Is that at the bottom? Fuck me. Oh, building value. End of camp. Oh yeah, the building values will actually add the end of game. Uh, I would like that. Wait, was it? The very bottom oh. number is the end value. So I would very much like that. So that's what I'm choosing. So that means we're opening crate C. Which I think is in here. I don't. I don't remember anymore, actually. Because crate C... Um... Oh, no, 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 I remember. I remember what the, what the crates were. The crates were this, which is story 129. Babe, what are you doing? I'm making sure they know where to go. They come on over now? No, but they're going to be here soon. It's soonish. Okay. Uh, crate C is 129. Eh. All right. Progression. The Forever King appreciates that you've made the choice to focus on progression as he needs the village to grow at a rapid pace to remain on schedule. Follow these instructions in order. Scoring. During end game scoring for the current game only, each player includes the end of campaign value buildings and their charter in their VP total. As a group, decide the name of the village and write it on the board. If there are any charters without names, name them now. Guideposts. Read this card to all players. Oh, the name of the village. So that, that's what the top one is. Oh. Okay, of the current game only. So, add all your little circles there. Twenty-four. And I guess we'll get there. Okay, so that's story seven. Eh. Oh, it's story seven. You can already tell which one of us. I want to make the king happy. Or well, you just want to piss him off. No, I don't, because you know what? He's fucking up to something. <laughs> so that was that. Um, do they get anything? Uh, rule one. No, I don't think so. Rule three. Oh, maybe. Extract. Extract card 160. Four. Eh. Um. I think that was supposed to go for them. And then do we have story seven? We just got story seven, yep. Card 129 or 130 extract and add cards 390 and 392 to the Anima deck. 390 and 392. I cannot stand this thing anymore. Okay. Okay. So yeah, they just got more more cards for their for their deck. That was story seven. So they progress as well. Um okay. So that was that, and then we got 402. Holy shit. Four o oh, that's the next charter. That's the game for. Have the most buildings in your charter. Temporary rules. After placing the progress token during game 4, set up advance in two spaces, shortening the game. So, so what happens if you're tied? Whoever has the most influence seems to be the tiebreaker. Um, 
At the end of the game, any player who achieves the guidepost gain one glory. Oh, players. Among those players, the player with the most influence tokens in the reveals the options on the guidepost. And you roll a chart or die to break. That player chooses one of the options and opens the corresponding crate. So, there it is. So that was open crate C. After opening one crate, place this card in the archive. All right. I think that was all of them. Okay, so that was the guidepost. Now we got in order to gain victory points for reputation and persona cards. Um, so you're going to get 10 points. I can put you at 60. And then, um, oh, how do, you, how do you win ties and reputation? And then the player, oh, I guess they tie for the same, so seven. 70, and then 65. Um, glory, each player gains glory based on their position on the VP track. All right, so can I have that marker? Please. Okay, so, and I actually won. Thank you, motherfucker. God. Okay. So I'm going to get seven, seven glory, eight, if I completed that. Oh, shit. I'm going to complete that. I'm going to fill that up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. And then eight. Let's go ahead and do resource. Okay, you're gonna get six. Um, but let me do that for them. How many is he's get? He's getting six as well. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then can I see his? Please. Eh. He's getting seven. Fuck you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, and you're getting six to color in your stars. All right, so that was that. That's what I think of Mr. Wilson. I shit my pants just now. Can you go? <laughs> I'm not getting any toilet paper. I'm thinking you go get my diaper. <laughs> so increase the capacity for one of your components on your charter chest. Also, what's wrong with me? Um. Yeah, it's like I want to continue without them. But then, I don't, know, I don't know what that would be like. It would technically just go to inactive um, and just slowly gain them and just be me and you. So, I don't know. Um, Did you color in your stars? Almost. Because right after you do that, you'll have to color in your one of your capacity thingies. And then mark some based on your capacity, keep some. Okay, so we're basically done doing all that. I increased everything on mine, so I start with three victory points at the beginning of each game, which is pretty cool. Uh, other than that, that was game three, everyone. I hope you enjoyed. Um, tell me if I'm wrong about the Automas again, because I'm not sure if I am. But other than that, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and have a wonderful whatever time of day it is for you. Hey everyone, thank you for watching, and I really hope that you enjoyed the video. If you want to support us, you can go ahead and click that link to go to my Patreon account. 
If you have any suggestions, you can go ahead and click the link in the show notes below to go to my board game geek, geek list. Other than that, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and have a wonderful whatever time of day it is for you.